I have zero energy um, and zero excitement about an all-star game this year. Um, you know, I, I don't even understand why we're having an all-star game. Pretty much a kind of a slap in the face. Um, and, you know, we're also still dealing with a, with a pandemic. We're still deal, dealing with everything that's been going on. And we're going to bring the whole league into one city that's open. Obviously being honored and obviously fans voting and, you know, the coaches and you know, other players. It's uh, <clears throat> something I don't ever take for granted. You obviously appreciate that recognition for sure. You know, we'll see about what the game looks like. There's obviously a lot uh, to, to find out about how that's going to come to light. So i uh, not ready to talk about that yet. I think it's kind of a force. I mean, but, you know, we all understand it's a business and what they're doing it for and what they're trying to get out of it. Um, I really don't care for it. If I make the game, I'm happy with it. If I don't, okay, my job is to try to lead this team and try to get us in the playoffs. Uh, I mean, if I'm going to be brutally honest, uh, I think it's stupid. Um, you know, if we have to wear masks and do all of this uh, for a regular game, then what's the point of bringing the All-Star game back? But obviously, um, you know, money makes the world go round, so it is what it is. But um, I mean, I'm not really worried about it. I'm voted, so be it. Damn, it seems like nobody's looking forward to the All-Star game this year. I understand why they aren't, but from a fan's perspective, I'm extremely happy that they're gonna have it. The All-Star game is something I look forward to every year, so I was mad they weren't gonna do it this year. But I'm glad they changed their minds now. We're about to see the best players in the world go at each other. You can't go wrong with that. And I love the energy they brung the last All-Star game. Even though both teams scored over 150 points, you could tell they was given more effort on the defensive end. But I wonder who's going to be the MVP this All-Star game. Kawhi won it the last time, but I don't know if he's going to win it again. If I had to bet on someone who's going to win it this season, I'ma go with LeBron. He's been having one of the best seasons of his career, and I think he's going to be motivated to win his fourth All-Star game MVP. If he does, he's going to be tied with Kobe and Bob Pettit for the most All-Star game MVPs of all time. He already has a lot of All-Star game records too. He has the most points, the most field goals made, the most three-pointers made, and he averages the most points per game, which is 24 and a half points. Well, who do y'all think is going to win the All-Star Game MVP? Let me know in the comments. And if you like this video, make sure you hit that like button and subscribe for more vids. Peace.